Good day, everybody. Mike Flores here, your local Las Cruces realtor and new home expert. Thank you so much for joining us on another beautiful tour in sunny Las Cruces. Today, I have the honor of presenting an Arista home. This is a builder that's been around for quite some years. Before we get started, I'd like to thank Crystal Frames with Steinborn Better Homes and Garden for allowing us to tour this amazing property. This property actually features just under 2,100 square feet. It's a three bedroom, two bathroom, two car garage. And you would think this is actually a two story, but this is actually a single story with very high ceilings. Now this is a barn look. Now this is like one of those Texas barns that has been retrofitted into a home but new and this is one of the talented builders in Las Cruces that does these and they build everywhere. They build in Metro, Talavera, Picacho, the Sanctuary, Mesilla. They can literally take this, they can change it, they can do all kinds of great stuff. Super super talented folks and let's get right into this folks. Starting with the outside of this beautiful home, look at this rustic contemporary coach lights. You got shutters up here, faux shutters. You got a really nice window with grates inside, eight foot garage door, looks like a barn door. And you have this really, really nice windows in here. And inside here, this would be the garage, but I'm gonna take you on a sneak peek into where people actually get to pick their colors, um, talk to their design, and see how talented these people really are. Now, outside, of course, you got really nice faux grass. You've got rocks, you got bowls, you have rock arroyos, two-tone gravel, lots of, this is really cool how they separate. You know, usually you see a fluid sidewalk here, you're actually seeing some really nice contrastic lines where they actually put the faux grass through this. And for those of you folks out there taking a look at this, this is not wood, this is actually tile or it's a ceramic and it goes all the way up. I would say that's at least 16 to 18 feet high. You got flat roof tile up there, I mean, Gosh, well, there's so much content. I wanna thank everybody for joining me today and thank you so much for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Please uh, click like, comment, and if you have any questions, of course, give me a call. Now, this front window, look at this. You got wood seal all the way across. You got this really cool overhang with tile up top and you got this wood accenting everywhere, like a tongue and groove all over the soffits, all the way around here, look at this. All this wood they do, and you have windows. Now these windows bring in, you know, really nice natural light penetrated the garage. Now if you wanted to not do windows or do more windows, of course they can accommodate that. Stacked rock all the way to the top. You have corbels up here. You have this exposed wood, uh, wood beams or joists. This is so nice. Wait till you see the inside of this home and make sure to stick around to the end because this home has an amazing backyard. Eight foot door, windows on the side. You got a really nice window up here with grates inside of it. Up top, you got a light, all LED, and this home is super energy efficient. Let's take a look at this. You walk in to literally 14 foot, 14 and a half foot ceilings. You got this circular, chandelier here with exposed, I mean, these are really nice, exposed beams. I mean, it's, you could say exposed, you know, um, joist or, you know, I mean, this is just beautiful. I mean, I'm in awe when I walked into this home for the first time, I'm like, wow, this home is, I mean, this is really rich. You got wood look tile and it's kind of like a grayish wood look tile, almost like a driftwood. You got reclaimed real wood on the wall right here. So, I mean, you can put pictures there. You can just leave it the way it is. It has a really beautiful farm coach light right over it. Now it's a smart home too. And there's a lot of smart features like cameras, automated showers, um, all kinds of cool stuff. I mean, smart thermostats, just to give you a few things of what they do. Two bedrooms in the front separated by a bathroom. And I love how they put closets right off the entry. This is for your coats. Let's take a look at that. Don't mean to open and close it on you too fast. I like this soft gray they did with the white. I mean, that really gives you really beautiful, soft, contrastic value. Over here, you got probably a linen closet. Yep. So you can actually put another hang there if you want to, but there's also a smart panel in here. If you can see that, that's where all your low voltage cable is, like your Cat6, Cat5, your RG6. Basically, everything comes from there and distributes from there to all the bedrooms, the great room, all that stuff. You could see in 2020, I mean, yeah, the, the barn dominium. Now I could tell you this, this got a lot of attention when it first came out. People came out, took pictures, did videos. Like I said, thank you, Crystal, for allowing us to view this beautiful property. Really super nice, honored to be here. 
Nice, look at this. You got a really cool contemporary fan. You got that rusted gray color. You got two windows with the grates in them. You got built-ins over here. This is really cool to put pictures. What they did here is they put a lot of artsy stuff, really cool contrast. And then of course, flat screen pre-wire. There's no carpet in this home. It's all wood look tile throughout. And then you have a closet over here. And they went a little bit beyond on this. They actually put short hang. They put extra cubbies, a little bit longer, a little bit wider. They put one here for hanging. And then of course they have their storage and it's actually in set. So it's not like right by the door. It's actually, I can step in here and uh, you know, all these homes with a little bit of space to storage. Now, you know, if you want storage, this home is about the only home I've seen with a finished attic and it's right above the garage. You can pull it down. Um, there's a staircase that comes down. I mean, what's not to like? Now, this is their office in the front. Look at that view. Talk about an amazing setting to work from. Built-ins everywhere. Um, for those that want to know the price of this, this home actually starts in the low 400s. This is the model home, so it has pretty much every option they have. This one you can expect to be in the upper sixes, maybe lower sevens. Um, if you were building off-site, it would depend on the land, of course, but yeah, this is unbelievable. All these built-in bookshelves all the way across. You got this right here next to the window. I mean, what an amazing, stunning setting here. And as we walk through, you'll notice all their awards. I mean, this is an award-winning builder here in Las Cruces. The smart switches, got dimmers on them and everything. I mean, this is beautiful. Now, wait till you see this. You walk into here, vaulted ceilings, exposed trusses with metal joists, Look at this. I mean, look at the lighting, folks. All this lighting across. I always say, look at all the lighting, the recessed lighting. This one has like chandelier after chandelier after chandelier. You got, I mean, it looks like a barn in it, but a modern, a rustic. I mean, gosh, I've, this is gorgeous. Almost like an industrial contemporary. And I mean, you got quartz everywhere, two-tone quartz. You got drawer stacks. You got the waterfall island. Look at this, even this, look at, look at this. By the way, look at the awards. I'll tell you folks, a lot of attention has been to this builder um, as they do so many custom jobs. If you're coming in from other states, you're looking, you would think this home would be millions of dollars. And believe me, if you were in a different state than Las Cruces or New Mexico, it would be. And even in our own state, like in Albuquerque or Santa Fe, this would be a million dollar home plus. So stainless steel appliances, large farm sink with an apron. This home does come with an RO system. So you have actually filtered water. It has a water softener, tankless water heater, super energy efficient, built-in five burner cooktop. You got the drywall vent with a unit built inside and you got these wood accents framing and the corbels. And then all this, this brick fascia. And it's not your red brick, right? It's like a, like a, Look at the grays, like the, the grays and the darks. And I mean, it's just beautifully done. Barn home, folks, you're looking for a modern barn home, barn dough, barn dominium. You gotta come look at these guys. Built-in appliances everywhere. You got the microwave, of course, the oven. You've got extra places here to put cooking sheets. Everything's on soft clothes. I mean, top quality. You've got all this here. You've got extra backsplashing over here. It's more of a, like a horizontal glass banding, really beautiful mosaic style. You got plugins, undermount lights. Um, this is like a glistening quartz. I could see like the glistening, like almost like there's diamonds in it. And then over here, you have this really beautiful quartz. Like, I mean, this is absolutely stunning. And you have a waterfall on this too. So it goes off to the side and they didn't forget the plugins. So they have plugins on both sides of this. Smart refrigerator, large windows, accent windows with grates all the way across. I mean, this is beautiful. Four inch crown molding on top of this. Their cabinetry has wood, it has the wood and the glass and it has actually lights inside to be able to like show off like your china or something special. Just great. And I love these refrigerators, by the way. If you haven't seen one of these, you can actually just knock on it and it turns on and it turns off. <laughs> That's so cool. You can open this up, you know, get to, you have a, the bottom freezer part of it where it just comes out on a drawer. I mean, beautiful, beautiful done. Right off over here, you have your laundry room. And let me tell you, you got this lower cabinetry, lower countertop. You got this really nice, this mosaic glass riser and you have built-ins up here for your soaps and stuff. And then over here, you have this really, really wide 
linen closet. So to put towels, to put extra, you know, you can basically use it for whatever you think, but just good spacing, great designs. Wait till you see the master suite on this one. Unbelievable. So the, the vault on this ceiling goes from a 12 foot to a 14 and a half foot center. So that's a 14 and a half foot tall roof. Of course, they have speakers in here. You can kind of hear the music. Really nice. You got plenty of spacing for, cat, for your, your couches, an extra table. I mean, that, that island's about 10 to 12 feet long. So I mean, you could literally just have dinner there if you wanted to. But man, I mean, they did a good job with staging the home too. You got this, all this reclaimed wood benches, beautiful dining table. Of course, if you wanted a, a, like a chandelier coming off that joist, they can do that. I've seen them do some really cool designs. Now, fireplace, you got this five foot fireplace that goes across. This is, it does change colors and it does put off some heat because of remote control. You got a bottom banco with wood. You got this really beautiful nicho. You got a mantle, floating, a floating shelf here. You got all this brick fascia with corbels. I mean, what's not to love about this home? Unbelievable. I'm not gonna show you that master suite yet. And also, if you look around, when you come in to visit these guys, they actually have the Grayson plan, the Mason collection, the Emerson collection, the Madison collection. And this home actually comes in four different styles. So if you don't like the barn, you want something contemporary, you want something rustic, you want something traditional, they have it all and they can actually change those as well. So I mean, beautiful, beautiful work. Now the corners on this, are 90 degree angles that gives you those really nice defined lines. And they did a really nice hand trout texturing here, washable paint. And then look at this, want a drink? And they make you, come over here and they make you a drink. You got your refrigerator here, your mini fridge. You got a place to put your dry wines. You got your, of course, your stainless steel sink. Again, continuing these really pretty faucets that they put in. You got the mosaic riser. I look at this and it just blows me away. But look at this wood up here. They put barrels up here to accent this. I mean, who doesn't want this in their home? I would love to have this. You got plugins everywhere. You got hidden lights, recessed lights, and then the door. Okay, this is a Pella door. Now it has a fiberglass outside. On the inside, it's a wood. It's wood clad. It does come with screens. And I mean, if you're an entertainer. You buy a home in New Mexico and your friends come and visit you like, why did you move to Las Cruces? Well, <laughs> this is why. You come out here, more exposed beams up here, exposed trusses with the metal accenting. You got a built-in kitchen. You got a place for the actual TV to go up nice and high. So if you're sitting over there having dinner with some friends, you can actually watch TV, watch the game, you know, whatever kind of television entertainment you like, watch New Homes with Mike, right? So in here you have this, this vent and this is built into the house. So as you're cooking, you don't have to worry about, you know, the smoke staining anything. It actually comes right out here. And they even put granite outside, which I really like what they did. And this has like a leather strap finish. It actually has like some texture to it. It's not like super, super smooth. I like that. Synthetic grade stucco out here. They actually put rounded corners very high ceilings, and then they can do pretty much anything from doing an outside fireplace to an outside fire pit. High, now this is in Metro Verde over by Red Hawk Golf. And I mean, out here, it's more of a planned development community, but they have lots pretty much everywhere. And of course, if you want that special lot, you wanna build in, you know, Mesilla or the Sanctuary or Picacho, Talavera, you know, North Valley, South Valley. I mean, then you name it, they can build it and they can take you pretty much anywhere. So if you're looking for someone like that, Arista might be the one that you're looking for. Faux grass, brick, you got a brick line all the way around it. it gives you very nice separation from the gravel. This is called a Palo Verde tree. You can tell by the green bark. And these are actually natural um, out here in Las Cruces. They don't you know, require a lot of water. They do bloom yellow. I mean, it's a really beautiful in the, in the spring. And they pretty much bloom all the way throughout the summer as well. And uh, don't leave you a big mess like some of the other trees that you find out here in, in Las Cruces. What is not to love Arista? You guys, I mean, my compliments to the chef. Now let's look at this master suite. Now entering, you have these really cool corbels on the side. And I mean, what a great way. If you can come like this, like you're coming this way and you walk and you even look in this way and you're like, oh, I'm in for a treat. I mean, take a look at this presentation. 
you got floating shelving in different shapes and sizes. You have a drop chandelier. This is a double door, so you can lock one of these if you want to, but it's a French door coming in. And I mean, seriously, look at this closet. Skylights, built-in cabinetry, place to sit down, kick off your shoes, plenty of hanging space, glass inlay, dressers, all built in, folks. This is not furniture that they, that they staged. Wow. Unreal. Come in this way, you got another, another skylight here. Very large, that's a king size bed. That might even be a California king. And I mean, look at how much space you still have to walk around. Giant, giant window. And these are all energy star. You can't even feel the heat through here, but you do get the light. And that's that energy star. That's that low E windows that they put in here. Very high end, lifetime warranty. Um, what a pleasure. Look at the built in shelves and racks here. I mean, you, I mean, they do this really well. They put different shapes and sizes. And I mean, you can put anything you want in here, books, you know, little figurines, you can put candles, you can put, I mean, you name it. Barn door, barn door in the barn home. Look at the painted tile. This is super nice, so painted tile. I mean, I bet you the reading room's even nice. Yeah, so obscure glass, high ceilings again, plenty of light, operable window. Now look at this, you got Quartz in here, undermounted rectangular sinks. Again, these rustic faucets, really nice hexagon deco all the way across that. You got framed mirrors and they frame this with like this reclaimed wood. I mean, gosh, that's so, such so much character. Drop, I mean, these are like pendant lights and they put them in here and there's five of them at different, different heights. It gives it that really cool depth. All these drawer stacks, big black hardware. Another, basically, who needs a medicine cabinet when you have these big cabinets on the side? I mean, my goodness. And then a smart shower, okay? Now, this, we actually only seen these one time in my videos. This is a Moen, I believe it's a MyQ. I'll tell you what they do is, I mean, you can connect this to Alexa and you can tell it to turn your shower on, turn it to 75 degrees, and it'll actually turn on. And to give you the scale and size of this, Deco flooring, big, nice wood look bench. You got tile to the ceiling all the way up. And look at this. You can actually see this, the stars while you're taking a shower. Rain shower head. Notice there's no faucet controls anywhere. Nowhere, because it's all done on the smart panel. It's done by voice. You could do it by Alexa. I mean, gosh. Wet nichos, removable, adjustable shower heads. Hexa, these are really nice. The deco floors they do in here gives it a really good contrasting value between the painted tile and then a frameless glass door. And this is like an eight foot glass door. I mean, look at this. Oh yeah. You got their black schlutering. So you got schlutering all the way around this. So it gives you that really cool frame look. I mean, just being in here and talking, I can feel the quality. I can hear the quality. When you're around homes a lot, you can walk through one and as you're talking and as you're, you're feeling things, you can actually feel the quality of these homes. And let me tell you, Arista has done an incredible job. I haven't seen any of the homes that I haven't liked. In fact, I listed one of their homes recently and let me tell you, I mean, I did a video on it. We got like 6,000 views in two weeks. I mean, unbelievable. Now in here, this is the actual pantry. The other side of the kitchen, it was the laundry room or, you know, the, the actually another other cool space with sinks and all that stuff. But in here you have lower countertop for the Java station. You got floating shelves with that wood. You got that deco again in the backsplash plugins, plenty of cabinetry. And then here you have a walk-in pantry. Beautiful. I mean, there's one, two, three, four, five shelves here. They're easy to get to. You don't have to worry about it being too high. Now, if you're about to deal with Arista, um, you're going to come into a place to actually go over um, some of their colors, um, pick, you know, all your, your, basically your styles. I mean, you can see the level of stuff they can do. And of course, if they don't have it here, they can easily get it. And above this is actually that storage I was telling you about. They finished off attic space and it's temperature controlled. So if you have stuff that are sensitive to the temperature, that would be a great place to store things. 
And as a homeowner, if you were to buy one of these, you know, you, you can actually do a lot of things with that. I, my kids would make that a playroom in a heartbeat. Now, if none of this was in here, you know, you, of course, you'd have the epoxy floors with speckle. And then over here, you'd have the RO system, the tankless water heater. And that's a really nice um, soft water system there. It doesn't even use salt. It's actually really super high end. And uh, your water here will always feel perfect. And there's actually a door in from the laundry room and a door in from the other side of the kitchen, which I think is great. And they do insulate their garages. Um, they paint them, they trim them. Eight foot doors, windows, they include the garage door opener. And then, of course, the windows on the eight foot garage door really sets it off, especially if you have mountain views through those. I mean, that's really nice. Um, and of course, they can even add a mini split to keep the temperature nice in here if you have that special car, if you spend a lot of time in your, in your garage. This is amazing. Well, folks, I think I'll end the video here. I want to thank each and every one of you for all the support, all the subscribing and likes. Super appreciate you. If you haven't, please do so. And if you have any questions about real estate, new homes, resell, or listing in Las Cruces, give me a call today. Thank you so much.